Listen, men. The old powerhouse is working again. There's water in that stream not two miles from here. What we ought to do is get that water down here to our crops. We've got five days to do it in, and I've got an idea of how it ought to be done. It'll mean work, work without stopping. Yeah, and what you be doing? Uh, <laughs> I'll be working right along with you. Now, you're going to follow me or quit like yellow dogs? Yeah, you're a fine one to be talking like that. Yeah, you're the guy we have to thank for being in this spot. Forget what you think of me. Think of yourselves. Think of your homes, your wives, your kids. Think of everything you've worked so hard for. Think of losing it because you wouldn't take another chance. Chris, you said irrigation would save the crops. By working day and night, we might be able to dig a ditch and bring that water down here. That'll save our crops, won't it? Men, it means everything in the world to you. Come on, let's try it. Chris, how about you? Hey, go get my shovel, Jan. Think it'll work, Chris? Go get your shovel. OK. If you go, Rock, I'm going to. All right. Yes, and I'm going too. Yeah, and take me with you. <laughs> and me too. We're not like we're going to win. Hello, boy, John. Come with you, John. Oh, come on, fellas. 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 So you were caught, John. You were exposed in front of the class. And what's more, Mary was involved too. Mary, who was only trying to help. And then what happened? Your classmates seemed to treat you a little coldly. Perhaps it was because they had studied and worked hard for their grades. Maybe they felt that your cheating gave you an unfair advantage. And their thoughts about you were reflected in another way. Hey, what's up? Meeting of the student council. That's funny. My name isn't on there. I'm on the student council. I don't think you'd want to come to this meeting. It's about you. Me? That's what I hear. Say, would you mind calling me after the meeting's over and let me know how it comes out? No, I wouldn't mind. No, I don't say that what John did was right, but I do think we ought to give him another chance. You mean you think we ought to let him go on being in the student council? I think we should. I don't. You've got to admit he's a good representative. That's right, but I don't think anyone that cheats should hold an office. That's right. I think we should elect a new representative. Well, no, give him another chance. All right, wait a minute. Wait a minute. We won't get anywhere by all talking at once. Are we ready to take a vote now? All in favor of giving John another chance, hold up your hands. All who think we should elect a new student council representative, hold up your hand. Well, I guess most of us feel the same way about it. Who's going to tell John? I'll tell him. I said I'd call him when the meeting was over. I'll call him as soon as I get home. John, I guess you know why I'm calling. We had that meeting about you a little while ago. They decided to elect a new student council representative. I'm sorry, Johnny, but I guess you know why.